ये बात कर लेते हैं हमारे स्पेशल कवरेज की कर्नाटक विधानसभा चुनाव से पहले हम आपके इलाके की हर एक समस्या को उजागर कर रहे हैं बीते पांच साल में आपके इलाके में कितना विकास हुआ या फिर स्थिति जस की तस है ग्राउंड जीरो से रिपोर्टिंग के लिए हमारी टीम इस बार जा पहुंची बेंगलुरु की राजाजी नगर इसे उन्नीस में बसाया गया इसका नाम नॉन ब्रिटिश गवर्नर जनरल ऑफ इंडिया सी राजगोपालचारी के नाम पर पड़ा सड़कों का खस्ता गार्बेज की समस्या के अलावा यहाँ क्या कहते हैं लोग देखिए Rajaji Nagar constituency it is a residential neighborhood and a business hub in the west of Bangalore Rajaji Nagar is an industrial suburb it serves as a center place to all in Bengaluru BJP has had a strong hold for over 15 years and now the total number of voters is 2,7622 in this constituency. This constituency is famous for its shopping malls, heritage temples and eateries. There are a number of concerns that have been upsetting the public for a while. Poor infrastructure, broken footpaths, killer potholes, unbearable garbage thrown all over and water crisis. So let's get the pulse of the Rajajinagar constituency. So we have lot of issues here. First, uh, the topmost issues is corruption, where everybody are talking that 40% commission the government is taking and the work is not to be done at all. If you can see right in front of me the drainage, what you can see and the road work, what infrastructure they have given, this is hopeless. Since four years, the work here the done is for uh, this is the fourth time. In four years, the fourth time and the work is not at all being completed. See, in Bangalore city, the citizens are asking for very basic work, which is uh, road, water, and street light. The demands would be like uh, we saw a lot of progress from past three years. After the COVID hit, we saw a lot of progress from this government, and we would like to see uh, another further progress. Like uh, we just got an expressway in the whole of South India. We, uh, Travelling to Mysore was a very hectic job, and uh, we can travel in one hour time now to Mysore. So many more such projects like uh, infrastructure would be great. Rajajinagar, as a constituency, we are happy with our constituency, our ward. We are happy because whatever is, uh, whatever problems we are having, it's been solved. As our ward is concerned, we are happy. As per the this thing area wise, you now already we are getting all the support from the government, and without asking us, they are all doing, and still they have to do more, the, like uh, improving the traffic, and also the parking. Parking is a very big problem in Rajajinagar. Each and every road car will be parked, and we got it every day fight with the public, so that they have to increase the parking. Uh, this thing very much. That is the very much needed for this area. So, I am a resident. I have been living here for 10-15 years. I am not aware of that. There are many new roads built. There are LED lights, CCTV surveillance, law and order. There are many good things. There are many good developments. 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 Elections come and go, but the people's demand and expectations are yet to be fulfilled. While we walked on the streets of Rajaji Nagar, we realized what the people wanted from their representatives. Very basic things like electricity, good infrastructure and safety. The fact the people are more conscious of the government facilities and taxes they pay is another important aspect of this. 
we at Mirror Now shall keep a track of elections happening and report on views and intentions of the people of Karnataka. With media journalist Santosh, this is Toya Jakshi reporting for Mirror Now from Bangalore.